Hi, I'm Randy Reed, editor of the Edison Report, and we are here at Education 2024, and this is Light Pitch. I'm joined by Dwayne Hillman of Ace LEDs. Dwayne, thank you for talking to me. Hey, Randy, thanks for stopping by. Well, appreciate we it. appreciate having you, and tell us a little bit about the emergency LED, and now that you are BABA compliant. Well, we're really excited about this, Randy. I mean, we've been in business now for 28 years, and uh, being able to bring product back to the U.S. is really important to us. It's huge to everybody. And I think we're one of the first, or one of the very few, that are actually going to build LED emergency drivers in the States. So uh, we're going to start that in April. In, Where? Uh, Arlington, Texas. Yeah. Right, tell me a little bit about your innovation lab. Is that in Arlington as well? Yeah, it is. It's actually a combination between our team in Arlington and also our team in Taiwan. And so what that's really designed to do is to help build specific products for particular customers. So we can design as well as manufacture, trying to get the right form factors to fit in certain fixtures. That's what that whole program's about, and uh, it's been very successful because we can do it quickly. That's the beauty of it. Tell us a little bit about your focus on LED driver technology. Well, our focus really is around three major things. So first of all is how do we build them smaller so you can get them into more newer LED lighting fixtures. The second thing is around cost, because nobody wants to pay a lot for lighting. So how do we get the cost out of it and keep the quality of it? And then third thing is a really power density. How do we get more power in those smaller form factors? That's where our focus is. So, so as a leader in emergency LED technology, what advice do you have for manufacturers when they're looking for emergency LED technology? Well, I think what's changed here over the last, I'd say, five to six years was the really the uh, development of lithium batteries. And so with lithium, it, it was a game changer from the lead acid. And so what that allows the Lumineers now is to get more emergency lighting in their fixtures versus going through a contractor and putting it in a wall somewhere. So I think they need to look at what fixtures can we add emergency to, look at the smaller form factors that are available at some very good pricing, and be able to build their line more on the emergency side that way. So, thank you very much. Hey,